to Junior 5. It's me again, Miss Radwa. I will be your math teacher today. Our lesson today is a um, very easy lesson. We took it before. Uh, it's about approximation. Okay, today we will talking about approximation. What is the meaning of approximation? We talked it before. Approximation. If I tell you that um, I bought a book yesterday and the price of the book was 35 and 8500 Isn't very easy to say it's 36. If you go to the shop or the mall and you bought anything and you see, look at the price and say it's 9 and 9900 it's easier to say it's 10. If I say, if I ask you, how old are you? Will you tell me it's 10 and 7 months and uh, and uh, and 5, uh, 30 day, uh, 25 days and so on? Or it's easier to tell me I'm 11, right? So approximation is express a number to the nearest given place. Express the number to the nearest given place. Okay, is approximation have a sign? Yes, like plus, like minus, like divide, like equal. Approximation have a sign too. The sign is similar to equal, but wavy a little bit. Okay, approximation and rounding have a rule. What the rule of approximation? I looking for the place I want to approximate. I want to approximate to the nearest ten. So I will look at the 10 place. Then I will underline it and look the number before it. Look at the number before it. What's the number before it? What is the place before 10? It's unit. If the unit place, the number in the unit, the digit in the unit place, 1, 2, 3, 4, I will let uh, the number in the 10 place as it is. If the number is more than 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, I will add 1 to the number in the 10 place. Okay? Okay. But what about the digit in the unit place? I will move this digit and put 0. Put 0 in any way? Yes. Okay. Let's have another example. Before taking any example, let's... Um, identify what is this this is a rounding coaster it's very very famous okay what this coaster tell us this coaster tell me that if you wanted to approximate any number or any place and the place before it the digit in the place before it four or less keep the number as the same keep the number the same if the place or the number in the uh, place uh, before it five or more five six seven eight nine add one give go higher add one to the place you want to, to approximate okay okay now i have a song for this rounding or approximation what is my song find your number look right next door four or less just ignore five or more add one more again find your number look right next to door four or less just ignore five or more add one more let's have some examples about rounding if i have this this number 3874 and i wanted to approximate to the nearest 10 where is the 10 place Excellent. It's a 7. Already I colored the 7 with red. Okay. Okay. Then I wanted to approximate to the nearest 10. Let's sing the song together. Find your number. I already find my number. It's a 7. And I colored it with red. Okay. Look right next to door. Where is my right next to door? It's a 4. Excellent. 4 or less, just ignore. Do I will add? Any digit to 7? No, I will never add any digit to 7. So I will write 3, 8, 7 and replace 4 with 0. So the answer will be 3,000.
870. Okay, let's have another example. 4156. I want to approximate this digit to the nearest 100. Where is my 100 place? Excellent. 1. 1 is the digit in the 100 place. I will sing my song. Find your number. I find already my number and colored it with red. Then look right next to door. Where is my right next to door? Excellent. It's a 5. It's a 5. 4 or less? Just ignore. Is it 4? No. 5 or more? Add one more. So I will replace this 1 in the 100 place to 2. Add 1 to 1. It will be 2. So the answer will be 4, 2. What about 5 and 6? What should I write? Excellent. Replace them with 0. We'll replace them with 0. So the answer will be 4,200. Let's have another example. If I have 82 and 97 hundredths, and I want to approximate this digit, this number, to the nearest unit. Excellent. To the nearest unit. Let's, let's sing my song. Find your number. Where is my number to the nearest unit? Where is the number in the unit place? Excellent. It's two. I already colored two with red. Okay. To identify it and mark it. Then look right next to door. What is the place or what is the number in the right next to door? Excellent. It's a tenth. Tenth place. What is the number in the tenth place? Nine. Five or more, add one more. So I will add one to two, it will be three, and replace nine and seven with zero. So the answer will be 83. If you wanted to add, uh, put the decimal point and add two zeros, it's right. Okay. The last example. 10 and 54 hundreds. I wanted to approximate this digit to the nearest tenth. Okay, first, sing my song. Find your number. Where is my number? It's a 5. I will color the 5 with red. Then, or you can underline 5, by the way. Okay, then, look right next to door. What is the digit in the next door? Right next. Very good. It's a 4. 4 or less? Just ignore. Do I, should I uh, add any digit to uh, 5? No, why? Because it's four or less, I will ignore. Okay, so the answer will be zero, one, zero, point, five, and replace four with zero. So the answer will be ten point five, or ten and five tenths. Why I didn't write zero, miss? I can write zero, but we agreed before when you writing a decimal, zero in the right with decimal with no meaning. Like zero in the left with whole number. Okay? You can add it or not, as you like. Excellent. We talked before how to approximate uh, to the nearest hundred thousand, ten thousand, thousand, hundred, tens, ones, and tenth. Today we will take two new places, which hundreds and thousands. Um, like we did uh, in once, tens, hundred, thousand, we will do in hundred, hundred and thousand. We will song our, sing our song and answer the. Now let's have some example how to approximate to the nearest hundred and thousand. The first section I want to approximate this number to the nearest hundred. What is this number? Seven hundred and five thousand. I want to approximate it to the nearest hundred. What does my song say? Find your number. Where is the number I want to approximate? It's hundreds. So what is the digit in the hundreds place? It's a zero. So underline zero or color it. Find your number. Look right next door. Where is the number in the next door? It's a five in the thousands place. It's a five. So look five. Five is four or less or five or more. Very good. It's a five and more. Add one more. So I will add one to zero. It become one and replace five with zero. So the answer will be seven hundred and ten thousands. Or we can move this zero because zero on the right with this in decimal with no meaning like a zero on the left with whole number. 
so the answer will be 71 hundred, uh, hundreds. Another question, 11 and the 42 thousands. I wanted to um, approximate this digit to the nearest hundreds too. Okay, look, find your number. Where is my number? In the hundreds place, it's a four, excellent. So underline four or color this. Then look right next door. What is the digit in the next door? Right next, excellent. It's two, two in the thousands place. Is four or less, just ignore. So it's four or less. I will ignore adding any any digit, any one. So I will put four as it is and replace two with zero. So the answer will be 11 and four uh, hundreds. Uh, but miss, what about this zero? Remove it. If you don't need it, remove it. So the answer will be 11 and four hundreds. Another example, I wanted to approximate this digit to the, this number to the nearest thousands. Okay, let's read the number first. 42 and 3,162 ten thousands. I wanted to approximate this number to the nearest thousands. Okay, let's sing our song. Find your number. Where is my number? Excellent. It's thousands. What is the digit in the thousands place? It's a six. So, color six or underline six. Then Look right next to door. What is the number in the next door? It's two. Four or less? Just ignore. It's a four or less. It's less than four, so I will ignore adding any one and put six as it is and replace two with zero. So the answer will be four, two, four, eight point three one six zero or forty eight and three thousand one hundred and sixty ten thousands. Or you can remove the zero on the right. It will be 48 and 316 uh, thousands. The last example. Okay, 73 and 297 ten thousands. I wanted to approximate this digit to the nearest thousands. What is the um, number in the uh, tens, uh, in the thousands place? Excellent, it's a 9. So I will underline 9 or color it. Find your number. Look right next to door. Right next to door, it's a seven. Four or less? No. It's a five or more. Five or more, add one more. I will add one to nine. If I add one to nine, it will be ten. So I will take twenty-nine together. Twenty-nine. If I add one to twenty-nine, it will be thirty. So the answer will be thirty-seven. Uh, sorry, seventy-three and and thirty um ten uh, and thirty thousand okay and thirty thousand uh, I have just finished uh, finished our lesson today. I hope you understand what i what I say uh, follow and answer the booklet um, a question and if you have any any question or any misunderstanding, please send it to me on the system. Thank you and have a nice day.